Welcome back to NicePage Website Designer, the unique revolutionary tool. We continue our video lessons to help you with NicePage. Let's add the text element by clicking on the Add icon to open the Add panel. On the Add panel, you can insert all the blocks and elements. Go to Add Panel, Text, Text. You can also use the Alt-T hotkey. When you click the text, you see the context toolbar with the most popular options. Drag the text element to the center of the block and align it with the magnetic guides. Let's add heading 1. Click the Add icon and select Text Heading 1. You know that Google loved heading and it is good for SEO. You can easily switch the element's places by clicking the Move icon on the toolbar or simply dragging an element above another. You can change the style of the text element by choosing it on the context toolbar, so there is no need to delete and add the needed. Let's switch the heading 1 and text to heading 2 and lead text correspondingly. Select heading 2 and make it bold by clicking the B icon on the context toolbar. Change its text size to 60 pixels and make it red. Now, we'll change the font. Select the heading and go to the right. You see the Property panel with all supported properties for the current element. The properties from the Context toolbar are also here. For example, the text style, size, etc. Now, you see the font family name of your heading. It is Roboto by default. Let's change it for Georgia. Now it looks more interesting. To edit the text, click the text element one more time or double-click if the text is not selected. Switch to a browser. Go to any junk text generator. Generate a paragraph. Copy it. Switch back to the Nice Page Editor and paste it to the text element You can see that the text element grows automatically bottom and to the dashed lines. Click on the Options icon on the toolbar and the Auto Width option is selected, which means that the text element will resize by the added text volume. If you drag the small semisphere resize markers on the sides of the text element, it will have the fixed width and adding the text volume will change only the height of the text element. Click the left mouse button below the text and heading and pull it above them to select all of them. Drag the multi-selection to the center and click somewhere beyond to unselect. We have finished the lesson about the text element. Thank you for watching.